start recording. All right, so, hold. all right, good. Okay, let's hope this works. Okay, this came on. Oh, it's connecting. Oh, shit. Yeah. Okay, that's, it's recording, but this is, oh my God, it's working. Holy shit. No fucking way. Oh my God. Hang on, I gotta find my controllers. Wow. All right, the controllers are on, but there's no moving with them or anything? Hello? No? Okay, I guess I don't move with these. Is it just, wait, oh, it might just be pure mouse and keyboard. Hang on. This is a demo after all, and so I was all set up to like, oh, Jesus Christ. What the hell are these controls? <laughs> all right, give me a second. All right, so like I said, this is a demo. So I am gonna still stand and like walk around because that's kind of like what I want to do here. Um, and as you've noticed, this is, <laughs> this is unreal. Um, I guess there's no controller support right now. Um, actually, wait a minute, does this work? Oh yes, the controller works, okay. That's good, that's good, that's good, watch this. All right, I can just take the controller, stand back, and oh, there we go. All right, that's way better. Holy shit. Okay, so I can fly if I look up because right now I'm literally just a camera. So I'll try to stay on the ground, but uh, Jesus Christ. This is, oh my God. Okay, I can go inside this. That's not, that's not right. That's not normal. So this is in Unreal Engine 4. Um, and this is a conversion to bring Unreal into VR. This actually just came out a couple days ago, uh, and I saw this and I'm like, oh my god, I have to try this. Uh, I don't think it's any secret that Unreal is my favorite game of all time. So when I saw this, I was like, holy shit. But yeah, it's being ported into Unreal Engine 4, just like a one-to-one -one ratio here to give a, 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 a VR experience. Ah, fucking bitch. Hang on. Experiencing some technical difficulties. I got a, I got a lot of cables running because as you can see, I'm using my lapel mic. Holy shit! So I can sort of like move out around anywhere, and my voice stays uh, uh, constant. Though I'm gonna try to stay facing the camera. I hope I'm pointing in the right direction. But um, yeah. So this is being made by a guy whose name I cannot say and I won't try uh, and embarrass myself. But I'll just throw it up on the screen. It's this guy. I'll have links if you want to like check this out. He put it up on a uh, mod DB, and I think right now it's just Vortex Rikers, the uh, the first level from Unreal. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to explore a little bit and see what else there uh, there be. Oh, this is so weird. Does this elevator work? Uh, no. Which is why we can fly. I guess that's the whole reason for this. Oh boy. Huh. All right. That's in the wrong place. This uh, this. This, this, right here, this cutout in the floor is supposed to be over there, not right here. I know my Unreal, sir. You did this wrong. Fix it. God damn it. Where's the flare? Where's the dead bodies? I'm kidding, this is fucking awesome. But that, that, that is supposed to be over there. <laughs> Ooh. Eh, jump. Wow. This is... Oh, this is so cool. This really puts a scale to things. Oh my god. Alright, let's get out of the prison room and actually go over to... Oh, god. oh, hey, I forgot about... Is this... There's no... Can I hit this? Oh, I see the lever. I can't... I can't seem to interact with anything. I hear the... Oh, shit. Yeah, it is in here. Look at this. It is here. He... What? So he ported the room over, because uh, that's the electrocution chamber, but I can't get down to it? How do I... I mean, the controllers don't work. Uh, alright. There might just not be a way to do it right now. Alright, before I get really motion sick, I'm gonna head over here. Pretend I'm going up an elevator, but I'm turning around. Ooh, okay. Oh. It's... Oh, boy. Oh, there is one over here. No, that's... Hmm. No, that's supposed to be here, though. All right, whatever. Anyway. Oh, look at this fucking vent. Dude, this vent is huge! Holy shit. This is so cool. Even though it's, like, low poly, because this is... This is just straight ported from 1998. 
right? So, oh my god, if this turns into a whole fucking game, um, this is open source and everything, so anybody can even, uh, contribute and work on this. Holy shit, alright. <laughs> Oh. Oh, this is not right. Oh. Uh, we have, uh, hang on, let me face the camera, turn around. We have, we have no volumetric fog. So this is, uh, this is just straight up fucking creepy right now. Holy shit. <gasps> oh! Ha! Oh, don't do that. Oh. Oh! Oh, that's how you get down here for the moment. Okay. This is, um... Mm. This is right in the electrocution chamber. Ooh, shiny. <laughs> Dude. This is nuts. Look at this fucking keyboard, oh my god. It's backwards. <laughs> oh, I, I am getting motion sick though. It's just, um, just because I have to move with this instead of moving with my body, so my brain like bleh. But, um, I mean, other than that, the scale is like perfect. I think the scale is really perfect. If we just had like proper controls for moving around, why is that texture like moving? What the hell? All right, let me let me try to get back up here. Oh god. Uh, flying. Oh god, too high. Uh, okay, here we go. I'm expecting to hear you have entered a restricted area. <laughs> Holy shit! I can't I can't tell you how fucking cool this is. Honestly, with Unreal being my favorite fucking game, uh, this is. Awesome to get to see something like this. This is so fucking cool. Holy shit. I wish I had some better commentary then. This is so cool. Holy shit. Just over and over. But it is! Dude, it's so cool! <laughs> man. That's a big fucking computer screen. I feel so tiny, man. Alright, so I don't know if the sense of scale is uh, sort of replicated for you guys exactly, but I'm a. Uh, I've crouched like all the way down, so I'm hitting the ground, so I assume this is what standing level would be. This is coming up to what feels like my kneecap right now, and these keys are like probably four times the size of my thumb, so <laughs> maybe this, maybe, maybe I was wrong about this, but again, that could just be the textures from the game, like I don't, I don't really know. This is so fucking bizarre. I wish I could just like walk around naturally and explore or use uh, the teleport feature just because like the motion sickness is really getting to me. Oh god, I'm gonna trip over a bunch of fucking wires. I need that, I need that wireless fucking setup that came out. The armor, did he? Wait a minute. Okay, I don't think the armory, I'm gonna, in editing, I'm gonna go play Unreal and look at this sign. I am pretty goddamn certain that there's no U in armory in the spelling in the original Unreal. Did he change that? What the fuck? This ain't no British fucking game, goddammit. Ooh, this is cool. <laughs> Aw, where's my armor, man? Where's the button that smashed my head? Oh my god, my whole head fits into this fucking ah! box. I, I do think the scaling is off then, because in the original game, I don't feel like your head could fit inside this box. I mean... Maybe? I don't know. I don't I don't think so. <laughs> yeah, some of the there's like no animated textures. Oh my god, this texture's so low res. A lot of the texture he's using are actually from the S3TC texture pack for Unreal, which was like of course the high res high resolution textures. Uh, so it it looks better than uh, the original game anyway to start. Uh, let's go down here. Whoa. All oh, the elevators missing. Uh, the sound, the sounds are all in. There's supposed to be the wire hanging here to electrocute you. The med lab. Oh boy. Ooh, there's some nice blood. Where's the bodies though, man? Where's my health pack over here? Where's my translator messages? Yeah, this keyboard is fucking gigantic. Holy shit. <laughs> it's really incredible being like in the fucking Vortex Rikers. Holy shit. This is so fucking cool. Oh, I gotta I gotta take a break for a second though. All oh, the motion sickness. Oh fuck. Oh god damn. Oh I'm not I'm not even centered. <laughs> How did I move over? Ow. Oh, it's 
give me a second. Oh boy, you definitely got some motion sickness shit to work out there. Again, I think it's just the movement right now. It's just, oh man, oh that's bad. I don't know if I can continue. I want to see the rest of it, but oh, let me let me get a drink of water real quick. Oh boy, I should also mention it's uh. It's like 3 a.m. right now. I just woke up, of course, and uh, I'm trying to be quiet for neighbors. Which is why I got this Pelma Pelkin. I can walk around anywhere, and you can still hear me lay perfectly fine. This thing actually has a really long cable. I'm like, I can fucking go into my kitchen. Yeah. <laughs> it's awesome. I gotta find a way to like tie up the cord with the cables for the uh, the VR headset, you know, so it just runs along with it so I don't trip over it as bad. I just have all the cables lined up. <sighs> I still feel kind of queasy. Damn it, I want to keep playing, but fuck. I don't want to throw up. <laughs> this is uh, not a good start if I want to be doing more VR games, which I do want to be. I do, I do, I do want to do, be, do. I do want to be doing more. I don't know if that English is right, grammatical structure. I want to do more VR stuff. That's, that's the point I'm trying to make. I've been wanting to do more VR stuff for a while. I've had this thing for a fucking year and I've done like maybe three VR videos, which is just pathetic. I know, I'll play VR chat. The greatest game ever made. Let me just let me just fly around like this here for a moment, uh, cause I can see it on my monitor. I mean, everything looks pretty one to one. Um, and I think this is the only level, oh, the fucking monitor's missing. This is cool. Whoa, okay, wait, so. Yeah, if I'm looking at the screen actually, this is like, being all the way down, that's not, that's not standing level. In the game, standing level would have been like this, I'd say. Oh, but I have the VR on the ground, hang on. All right, so, turn around. Yeah, okay, so th this is this is standing level. This looks normal. Uh, this looks, this looks correct, I'd say. I do want to see what the engine room looks like in VR, though. <laughs> my forehead's so sweaty. Ha <laughs> This is cool. Pretty light. It's so, it's so interesting seeing this with, um, uh, real-time lighting and everything. Oh, man, I wish I had, the, like, the fan spinning. Uh, or it would be over there, but... That sign is so fucking cute. First aid station. <laughs> Great glass. I wonder how much, I wonder how much sweat this, like, foam padding collects. Fucking gross. <laughs> now, so you have this with the lever. I guess there's no movers or anything right now. And then you go over here and hit the. Uh... Oh, that doesn't do anything. That's not. That's that's not glass. Why is there a big old cover on that? All right. So there's there's no way to like get out or anything. All right. I'm gonna I'm gonna cook. I'm gonna conclude the uh, the video here since it's just a demo right now. I just wanted to show it off. It looks fucking cool as fuck, and I'm. Oh, I'm so queasy, holy shit. If we, if we actually get Unreal, like a straight up port of a, a one to one ratio of Unreal with VR support that's like has the gameplay and the weapons and we can run around and fucking shoot things and play the original game, I, I am so gonna do that. I am 100% gonna do a, like a full fucking let's play of that. And what's funny is me and a group of other people have been working on porting, uh, sorry, not porting, actually doing like an Unreal HD remake. Um, a lot of people have just been sort of throwing in little bits of contribution for this, and I'll throw up some screenshots for you guys to look at. Uh, but we've been like remaking uh, the models and the creatures, and we have some of the, some of the levels, like uh, a bit of Nileve is already done, and we're like trying to keep to the original Unreal style, but make it look like it was made in 2017, 2018, you know? So this this is like completely separate from that. This is gonna, this looks like uh, it's just gonna be a straight up one-to-one -one conversion. Just a straight up port over uh, just so that we can get VR because there's no way we could do VR in the original engine I just I just don't think there's any way to do that or it would even support it even though we do have the source code for that engine Maybe I mean, we did port physics over like phys X into it uh, and a bunch of other stuff. I don't know <laughs> I should ask Smurf about that. But anyway, this is fucking cool. Holy shit. I'm like I, I saw this and I'm just like I gotta fucking do a video about this This is so fucking awesome people people need to see this. I have a VR headset it's my favorite fucking game of all time. It's just, <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't know what else to say. I don't do outros. Thanks for watching. Look, I said that thing you're supposed to say at the end of videos.